Hey guys, the Butler Bulldogs just uh, got done with their game with the Fordham Rams, and it was kind of a disappointing game. I expected more out of Butler in this one. It was uh, against a pretty bad team, and they squeaked out a win, 68 to 63. I know it was a road game. I know it was a win, but you know I'm just looking. For, I'd, I'd like to see a blowout, and Butler hasn't really had many blowouts this year. They they like they like to play close games for whatever reason, keep things interesting. Uh, but anyway, Roosevelt Jones had 13 points in this game on 5 of 9 shooting. Kyle Marshall had 4 points on 2 of 5 shooting. Andrew Smith had 12 points on 3 of 7 shooting. He was 0 of 2 behind the 3 point line. Alex Barlow had 1 point on a free throw. Uh, Rodney Clark had 22 points on 6 of 16 shooting. He was 4 of 10 behind the 3 point line. Kellen Dunham had 9 points on 2 of 8 shooting. He was 2 of 7 behind the 3 point line. And Cameron Woods had 7 points on 2 of 2 shooting. Uh, Butler shot 39.2% from the field. Fordham shot 38.1%. Butler shot 28.6% from the three-point line, while Fordham shot 21.1%. From the free throw line, Butler shot 64.7%. Fordham shot 73.3%. Rebounds, Butler won this battle 42 to 38, and uh, Fordham won the turnover battle 11 to 14. Butler improves to 21 and 5 on the season, 8 and 3 in the conference. Fordham drops to 6 and 20 on the season, 2 of 9 in the conference. Fordham, one of their top players, just came back. He'd missed like seven games, and uh, he was definitely a, a big factor for Fordham. Kept them in this game, um, but still, they've only won six games, and it was just kind of a disappointment that it was that close. Butler's really going to have to get things going. Um, they're playing, so they, this was the 15th place team in the Atlantic 10. Now they play the 16th place, which is last. On, uh, on this week, this coming week, uh, they take on the Duquesne Dukes, a team that's only won like eight games. So hopefully Butler can blow them out. That's a home game, so they should be able to do something. Um, you know, something big. And uh, then we got to prepare for St. Louis. So anyway... That's the recap. You guys have a great day, and I will see you next time.